Hello, hello, blessings. Thank you for tuning in once again. We are grateful to connect with you. This is the beautiful Maggie from Fairy Vibes. Hello. This video, we're gonna be talking about soul sovereignty. Maggie, what is soul sovereignty? What does it really mean? What, <laughs> what really is 5D? Mean? What is okay, 5D? so soul sovereignty <laughs> is when you are focusing on yourself and solely working on reaching your highest potential and not focusing on anyone else's reality or blaming. It's all about getting out of victim mentality as well. Taking complete responsibility for yourself and every aspect of your life. Yes, this is so important right now because as we are making this shift into higher consciousness, it is a collective effort, yes. But in order for us to literally raise our frequency collectively, we have to first do it on an individual level. It is necessary. We are being called to align all aspects of ourselves. And how we do that is becoming fully aware of ourselves on every single level, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, energetically, and just fully adjusting yourself to be in accordance with your highest self in all ways. Everyone is a version of yourself and yeah. every person is playing out a role for you. So if you have a discord frequency inside of yourself, you're going to attract someone who is going to let you know about the discord frequency inside of yourself yes. so that you can heal that aspect and step into your more sovereign self. Yes. And so really not being angry or upset with anyone outside of yourself either because you're just holding that vibration inside and yes. so stepping into your sovereignty is being at complete peace with everyone mm -hmm. and realizing everyone is playing out their role perfectly and mm -hmm. thanking them thanking yes. them if they upset you having gratitude and know that according to universal law no one can actually make you do anything no one has ultimate control over you no matter how powerful strong they appear to be Ultimately, it is you who is creating and directing your reality. So certain people can trigger you into lower vibrations or they can encourage your vibration to overall lower, but ultimately they do not have control over you. So in knowing that you are a full sovereign soul, you are fully in control of yourself. Is that dog serious? <laughs> <laughs> just wait <laughs> then you can fully take responsibility for how you are feeling thinking acting and expressing another really important aspect about soul sovereignty is to be fully conscious and aware of all that you are consuming that is on a physical level like the actual foods you are consuming an energetic level the people you are around the environment that you're in, on a spiritual level, what you are believing to be true, are you fully honoring yourself as a director of your life, as your own God, are you feeling good about everything that you are doing and intaking, and is it raising your vibration or is it lowering your vibration? So take responsibility, be fully aware of all that you are consuming and do it from a sovereign soul self place. Yes, and I would say that the last aspect, I mean, soul sovereignty, we could go on forever, but yes. it's also about being in harmony with the earth. Yes. So as you step into your sovereignty, you're in harmony with the people and the earth as well. Mm -hmm. And so you are not creating a discord frequency with the earth by creating too much trash. And also you can just be more of a sovereign being by bringing your own bags to the grocery store, really trying to consume less waste and move towards that zero waste lifestyle. I mean, Earth has to eat everything that we, all the trash we create. So imagine trying to eat plastic because that's what Gaia literally has to do for us every time we buy something with plastic in it. Yes, use the bulk section, make sure to recycle, make sure to compost. Again, soul sovereignty is really just taking responsibility for your incarnation, for all that you are doing, consuming, thinking, feeling, and expressing as. Love that. 
Yes. Taking responsibility for your incarnation by being the most harmonious being you can be. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in. We love you. Namaste.